The DR3231 is a low-cost, extremely accurate I2C real-time clock with an integrated temperature compensated crystal oscillator and crystal. The device incorporates a battery input and maintains accurate timekeeping when main power to the device is interrupted. The integration of the crystal resonator enhances the long-term accuracy of the device as well as reduces the piece part count in the manufacturing line. The DS3231 is available in commercial and industrial temperature ranges and is offered in a 15-pin 300-min SO package. Now let's do a simple module test. First, connect this board to computer with a USB cable to download the program. Then go to device manager to check if it is correctly connected. Right-click computer, go to properties. Click Device Manager and click Port. You can see Arduino Uno R3 COM6, meaning board is successfully connected. Now open Arduino IDE, click Tools. For board, select Arduino Uno. For port, select COM6. The same with settings in Device Manager. In here, we can compile a program or directly copy and paste the program. For all of our products, we have supporting files from where you can find sample program for this module. First, let's take a look at the code. The first two lines says include wired H on DS3231.h. So we need to place these two files under the directory libraries of Arduino. Open Arduino directory, go to libraries. You can see we already placed the file DS3231.h under this directory, also file wired H here too. So now we can directly copy the program and paste it here. In this experiment, you also need to change the baud rate to 57,600. Now click verify to check compiler mistakes. If code are correct, click upload to upload the program to the board. After uploading is done, let's do the wire connection. You can see for this module, there are four pins, negative pin, positive pin, SDA and SDL. We connect negative to ground, positive to 5 volts, SDA to A4, SDL to A5. The same with settings in the program. Then open serial monitor, you can see the date is displayed. Of course, you can change the code to display different dates. Test is now complete. Thank you.